Hi, I'm Jim Buckman. I'm an urban mission strategist working in New Jersey. And one of the enjoyable parts of my job is working with Pastor Paul Critch at Redeemer in Westfield. I work with Pastor Critch and uh, his members in starting Anchor of Hope. It's a new congregation that's being formed through Redeemer in Westfield. And we are starting this uh, new church through prayer walking in the business district of Westfield. And prayer walking is something that's very simple and easy to do. You can do it in business districts, you can do it in residential areas, and basically all it is is going introducing yourselves to other people, letting them know that you're praying for the community and that you'd like to pray for them, and then asking them what you can pray for them for, and, and then getting their name and, and going and praying for them, and then following up. One of the men that we connected with through prayer walking is, uh, uh, now uh, a member of Redeemer and um, not only a member of Redeemer but goes out prayer walking with us and he owns a business there in in Westfield a delicatessen there in Westfield and he has opened his deli up for us to use for our church plant and so he has provided the physical location for the first satellite church and he himself is very interested in the non-residential track to ordination he has a bachelor's degree so he would go into the SMP program at one of the seminaries and um, and then through this if that was to come to fruition we would actually have uh, recruited uh, a man off the streets through prayer walking and then using the non-residential track for ordination we would then have an ordained LCMS pastor doing ministry under the auspices of an established LCMS congregation and this would have been all done at little to no cost to the local church and he would leverage his relationships in the community. In fact, Greg already does that. He already uh, spends probably 20 to 30 hours every week talking about his church and talking about the new church plant, uh, in effect, the local church has gotten a part-time staff person at no cost added to their ministry. And so it's very exciting to see this happening, and uh, it's a privilege to work with churches, uh, helping them grow and reach their community with the saving gospel of Jesus Christ.